I want to know this from you. Doing a lot of movies, of course, you have to have your favorite, right? Yeah. Uh, who's the favorite person, I guess you can say, that you've been able to attach yourself to in comedy? You shared the screen with. Who's your favorite? You can leave me out of it. I don't want the pressure. If you feel like you have to say me because I'm here, I already know where you put me. So let's not even do that. Oh, good. All right. Because you're uh, number 15. You're probably the 15th best person I've worked with. And that's high, because I've worked, I've done a ton. Yeah. I'll take it, I'm saying. You're in I, top 15. Yeah, but that's what I'm saying, you didn't have to say it at um, all. Um, I mean, obviously, created a bond with John C. Riley. Mm-hmm. Super fun, great guy. So why can't you just say John C. Riley? Uh, I did, didn't no, I? you said, obviously I created the bond, but you didn't say, John C. is my favorite. I, I, I don't know if I, I mean, uh, yes. Oh, okay. you stutter it. It's a, it's a simple question. John C. Riley. Okay. But, I, but I've enjoyed... So you think John C. Riley's better than me? <laughs> oh, man. I'm not putting you on the spot. By the way, by the way, I don't even care. I don't even care. I don't want you to think that I'm even into this, because I'm not. But if I was, you think he's better to work with? If so, why? You told me it didn't matter. It doesn't. Forget it. Throw it out the window. Throw it out the window. Close it. Throw it out the window. I'm not close saying he's better than you. Yeah. That's, and by the way, if yeah. he was, that's fine. Okay. No, I'm not saying that. Yeah. It's fine. Because we all have our distinct exactly. abilities, what we do better than other people in this and that. Is that why you've never done another movie with me? Huh. Yes. Wow. That is it. <laughs> <laughs> that... That's totally it. No, you and John C. Riley are something different. It's a, it's a comedy yeah. duo that... <laughs> you, the, the thing that... It, the action that's happening, especially in regards to comedy, is obviously not written, but the comfort that you guys have right. in one another and the trust that you guys have in one another uh, yeah. and the ability to, like, exchange the levels, right? When I right, look right, at you right. guys as Step Brothers and I look at you guys at Talladega Nights, I'm looking at two different performances, but I'm also looking at... Uh, changing of the guard in both situations. Yeah. And there's scenes where you guys are clearly giving the other yeah, for the sure. world of. Um, and that and that kind of common goal of of uh, you know just playing it through the character as opposed to yeah not not keeping track of who's gonna do end what up funnier. Yeah. You just yeah. Like, the, yeah. you don't care though. You don't care. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, just serving the story and and uh, um, but. I, I, I was also going to say, what's really been enjoyable has been working with non-comedic actors who mm. you find a way. So, like, if we're going to use Step Brothers as an example, um, Richard Jenkins, oh like God. casting someone like Richard Jenkins and getting this amazing comedic performance. Grounded out of him. comedic performance. Exactly. Grounded. That's like it balances out with what you're doing, and that's that's the beauty yeah. to what you do well. 